is a selection of contacts with something in common, such as contacts who work on a specific project or those who work in a similar field. If you regularly look up contacts that share a common characteristic, you may want to consider creating a group for them so you can more efficiently work with those contacts. To create or manage groups, click the Groups button in the navigation bar. This opens the Groups view, which is split into three sections. On the left is the Groups tree, which allows you to view all groups, as well as create a group hierarchy to better organize your groups of contacts. The top half of the right side displays the group name, as well as an optional description, and the last time the group was edited. The bottom half enables you to add or remove contacts, view activities, opportunities, or other information relevant to the group. The Group Info tab allows you to restrict access to the group as necessary. Contacts can be added to the group either by adding a contact directly or by using dynamic criteria. To add a contact directly, simply click the Contact button and choose a contact to associate with this group. To create dynamic members of a group, click the Edit Criteria button. By using the Query tool, you can define conditions to identify contacts to add. If you would like to create similar groups, but with slight modifications, after highlighting a group, you can select Duplicate from the Groups menu, or right-click the group and select Duplicate. Then you can choose how much information is carried over. You can always delete a group at any time, and any group can be made a subgroup or even promoted to a parent group by highlighting it, and from the Groups menu, selecting Move Group, or by right-clicking on the group and selecting Move. As we have seen, groups enable you to collect multiple contacts into a single group. <laughs>